Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Lee and you're watching Infinite Music Reactions. Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make a, a professional looking thumbnail on your videos without by using TubeBuddy without having to pay for the subscription which sounds a bit naughty but there is a loophole where you can make uh, a decent thumbnail without having to pay sort of thing and today I'm going to show you that but before we do if you do like my videos then please hit like and subscribe right now moving on obviously when you do the um uh, well sorry I'm going to do it on one okay rock here which is the I'm a, I do music reactions, so obviously I do thumbnails. Now, as you can see, it's just a picture of me in the top corner, and that is the thumbnail that you give you. Now, on 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 this, we have to go on to create thumbnail, and then you get these options. You get still from video, solid color, exist, image or existing thumbnail. Now, the problem is when you go to your images, right? You'll put the image in, say, for your background, then you go to your layers, which is all the layers that you put on for your um, thumbnail so if you want a background right you add it so if in my case i'm going to go to uh, the one okay rock picture that i've downloaded so i click the one okay rock picture and then you click it to put it on then you obviously expand it to make the size of your thumbnail now you want to be putting a frame on there you click on frame sorry th the thumbnail frames are only available for pro level so you think oh damn we can't put a frame on but we can now what you have to do to that is um, download a frame that you like say off Google images and then go to um, remove.bg once you've loaded up remove.bg and you've got a frame for yourself you, you upload the image to it so in my case I have got a uh, one already downloaded now this is the frame that I've downloaded here so I double click on that and as you can see there you go Everything is removed off that thing. So you obviously you download that and save it. I've already done that once, so I'm not going to do it again. So basically, we go back to the um, studio. Now, back to the images. Now, obviously, if you go to open another image, again, you get your frame. But then it says license. You can't use it. So what you have to do is delete this one OK Rock picture. And it'll leave a little one in the corner so then you open it up again it's still there put it in then go to images and now you've got a slot to open your um open your frame so there's my frame you open it put it on it's there again image delete it and as you can see the frame is still there so then we expand it and make it part of our thumbnail so then we put the obviously put the frame in there okay so then back to images and then plus and then obviously I have a um, I have a file where I have all of my pictures of myself for the pictures for the thumbnail should I say so we open that and then obviously I've got all these here for myself so I'm just gonna bang the one that I showed you I want to see which one it is there so obviously that is now in there, so you can bang it on. Wang the picture of myself in there. And then up here, as you can see these bits, there is um, a shadowy thing. There's a dark one and a light one. You can either have a normal shadow like that, or you can have like a light shadow. I prefer using a light shadow. So then that's on there again, so all your images are on. Now it's just a matter of putting your text in and um, selecting your font. There's not so many fonts to choose from, but hey, it's free, what more do you want? Um, so obviously, I'm gonna put music reaction, because that's what I do. And then when you click next to that, you can choose your colors and stuff, which I've just showed you. I just didn't say anything. <laughs> I'll do it on the next one and show you, obviously. So then you click text again to put something else in, because um, you can put another, obviously, as many lines as you want on the text. Now, but here where the colour is, there's the colour. You click, click any colour that you like, and next to it is the outline. So, this song is called The Beginning. Uh, I always put that in inverted commas, so it's accentuated. And then, if you add the layer, you see that there's no outline around it. So, go back to next to the colour, there's a, a circle around a grey dot. Click that, and then it gives you the line so again 
that goes over there and then next one I always put the band name in a different color so I can show you that anyway one okay rock and then we change the color by clicking on the color chart press choose click the black line to make sure it's outlined and add layer again and there we go one okay rock the beginning music reaction all the text is there my pictures are the frames are and so is the background so it looks like that what you'd get when you do with um, a full subscription thumbnail click continue save and publish publish the thumbnail when you go back to your channel's content one okay rock there you see it worms doing the mouse if you refresh then there is your thumbnail so when people see that now all they will see is the one okay rock thing and you didn't have to get the subscription anyway if you like my videos then please hit like like and subscribe and i shall see you all on the next one